What's up homies, today we are going to take a look at the Basilisk Yo-Yo from ZGRT. Now this is an awesome mono metal that will not break the bank. It's only 60 bucks and it can literally do anything. Let's check it out. Alright, so here's the packaging for the Basilisk by Zero Gravity Return Tops. And this is actually designed after a Basilisk Lizard, so very, very cool. Um, I'll put all that information um, quoted from their website down below in the description. You can read more into that. Super cool. Um, it's like a lizard that can run in water. It's from the iguana family. And um, yeah, there you can see there's one right there. So it's one of those things. Very, very cool. And I must say, this area looks badass. Um, for the lack of a better word. Oh, here we go. There's a basilisk right there. Pretty cool ass sticker, I must say, too. And, um, you know, some nice string. You're really set up, ready to go right there. Um, packaging, we'll put it over there because this is really what we care about. We're going to put the specs um, right there. But it feels very nice. Like, overall, super nice as far as the finish, just how aesthetically pleasing it fits in my hand. I always like um, V-shaped joys like this. This To me, just looking at it, it looks like it's going to be a very fast-playing, um, rim-weighted yo-yo. Uh, I, I, you know, I like any more angular yo-yos, and this looks like it'll be right up my alley, and it feels super rim-weighted just from holding it in design. Obviously, we have a finger spin, um, little nimble there, whatever you want to call it, a little indentation, so very cool. Groove, whatever. I like the nimble, the made-up word. That's what I usually call it. Nice laser engraving. Um... Um, the white pads and it's a concave bearing we got looks nice stainless steel axle and uh, yeah pretty standard all that stuff and I believe these are like $58 being extra I was careful when I first put a yo-yo to get back together for the first time um, but yeah looks like we're good to go and uh, yeah I'm really concerned more with how it's going to play than how it looks, but how it looks is badass. So if it plays half as good as it looks, we, sh we should be in pretty good shape. Let's find out. All right, guys, we are back in the saddle again with the Basilisk, and let's start off trying out a fingerspin because it does have this nice fingerspin dimple uh, with it as well. And as you can see, um, it actually, fingerspin DNA, whatever you want to call it, very very well well enough to really jack up my string tension but we are good now so if that's a trick you're looking to do definitely a good yo-yo to start with okay just as i was expecting it is a very fast playing see the string that my string tension got a little jacked there with that finger spin hold on because it shouldn't be catching on these over under boings i did a couple off camera and it was not catching. Whoops. That's me. Yeah, see, this is my string tension. So even out of the box, the response is very good. Where I'm getting pretty good binds. Um, and everything. You know, it's not snagging when I don't want it to. As long as your string tension doesn't get a little mangled from doing DNAs and stuff like that. Well, come on, Mohawk, don't get in my way. There we go. The size is definitely very competition feeling you know it feels like a competition sized yo-yo everything's fairly easy to hit so far like anything I miss has nothing to do with like you know the yo-yo not being big enough or anything like that it's just I missed it you know yeah really really long spinning too and this finish super super nice and nice rounded edges too like right there I whacked it on my hand it wasn't, I didn't feel it or anything. Yeah, but very, very stable, very long spinning. Feels super nice. In the $58, I think it is, or whatever, $60 price point, we'll call it. I'm very much a top contender. Um, the weight is really like perfect. It's 65 grams, so it's kind of what everyone's used to nowadays. Kind of what most people like. 
Oh man, and the finish is really nice depending on whatever type of grind you're doing. Just a very nice, or just, you know, overall in your hand when you go to throw it. Just very aesthetically pleasing overall. A big thumb grind lift. That should be a trick that we should be able to do in our sleep here. So let's see if I can, no, I'm just kidding. Uh huh. I couldn't even do it with my eyes open. There we go. But yeah, big thumb grind lift. Yeah, very easy to catch. Especially once you get the, oh yeah. Like that one, I was pretty aggressive with it. Still, no problem. Big fat thumb grind lift. And that also is why it's so freaking rim weighted. Um, but in the best ways. I think that if you were like a horizontal player, this would probably be a really good yo-yo too. Um, I suck at horizontals. I'm the last person that should tell you anything about that. But that being said, I think this is probably like a, a really, really good yo-yo for stuff like that. But yeah, once again, I'm not even going to try to do anything. I'm, I'm freaking... Absolutely terrible at horizontal, and the last person you should ask. But so far, it does feel like one of those yo-yos that's anything in the 1A, 5A, 5A, this would be a great yo-yo too. Anything in the 1A, 5A thing, this should be a yo-yo that can really handle it, no problem. Yeah, but the size is very, very nice. Like whip tricks feel super natural on this. And I'm pretty out of practice right now. I'm like, I have not been yo-yoing much lately at all. Like basically the only yo-yo I've been doing is when I'm on camera. <laughs> so other than that, I really have not been, not been yo-yoing too much. I've just been super busy. Um, work's been crazy and stuff, so. We got a lot of people at the gym fighting and yeah, it's just been, Crazy summer. I've been trying to fish as much as I can too, and all that good stuff. But even being like super out of practice, this yo-yo feels like 100% totally natural. Like you could just pick this yo-yo up any day and be able to do whatever on it. It feels super nice. Yeah, and the rounded edges are really nice when it whacks under your hand like that. Like. I can like purposely whack this yo-yo against my hand. Not even, not even really care at all. It doesn't doesn't hurt whatsoever. Yeah, finish is really nice, and I really dig this, um, this particular colorway they sent me. Um, but I saw some of the other ones, and they're also super awesome. So I'll put the links down below. Definitely check this out. In the sixty dollars price point, it's gonna be hard to beat a yo-yo like this. If you like angular yo-yos, you'll really really dig this. Um, especially with the nice soft edges, it's not too aggressive or if it hits you in the face you're gonna need stitches or anything um you should be okay most of the time so i'll see you guys later peace out and uh shout out to zgrt for sending me this awesome yo-yo we got a couple more things to check out from them down the road so hit that subscribe button hit that like button and uh stay tuned because we got some more awesome yo-yos from zero gravity return tops and stay tuned because we're gonna check them out see you later and peace out